Hi guys, welcome to Doggypedia. Please click on the subscription button and notification bell so you don't get to miss out on our next video. Parvovirus. The following video is about Parvovirus and my American bully puppy called Gaddafi. I've only had Gaddafi for a month. I got him from a breeder dewormed and vaccinated twice, but yet to my horror, my dog was showing symptoms of parvovirus. You watching this video because your puppy is going through the same or you want to prevent it from happening to your dog. I had to spend 2,500 the first day he was admitted at the vet and 800 a day for four days. Unfortunately, I had to ask the vet to stop treating my dog because I ran out of money. I will be taking Gaddafi home and with the little that I have, I will give it all to save my dog. Keep watching and let's see what happens next. What is Pavo? Pavo is a highly contagious airborne virus. It is spread through infected dogs, dog feces, flies, and contaminated areas. It causes an infectious gastrointestinal illness in puppies between the ages of six weeks and six months. 80% of the time without treatment, puppies die within the first four days. The virus infects the small intestine and destroys the stomach wall and disrupts the gut barrier. This impairs absorption of anything your puppy eats or drinks, causing your puppy to have pain, nausea, diarrhea, and severe dehydration. Symptoms of Pavo are vomiting, bloody diarrhea, weakness, weight loss, depression, dehydration, anorexia, lethargy, and fever. If your puppy is showing signs of these, don't waste time. Take him to the vet immediately, which is what I did. As soon as I put him on the examination table, he pooped a lot of blood that smelled horrible. The vet admitted him and said he would have to stay there for treatment at least for five days. Remedies for parvovirus. The real cause of death in puppies is not parvovirus itself, but dehydration that follows after countless amounts of vomiting and diarrhea. The first thing to do is take action and do not waste time. The first three to four days are crucial. If you take your puppy to the vet fast enough, they will administer fluids in your puppy in the form of an IV. The dog will be quarantined for up to 10 days of treatment. When your puppy is discharged early like a doffy, your vet will give you medicine to treat your dog at home. The medicine includes an antibiotic that is called anamoxicillin and Diomec Plus, which is a paste that normalizes the digestive system of dogs suffering with diarrhea. Remember, I'm not a doctor, so this does not constitute as medical advice. Very important, if you can't afford a vet, you need to get yourself a few things. First is a syringe, just like the one in the video. Baby food with chicken, beef, or pasta with no garlic or onion. You need to get yourself some electrolytes in the form of liquid or powder. For liquid, you can get Pedialyte, in powder form, you can get rehydrate. In powder form, you can just mix it with tap water. I suggest you also get your puppy some Diomec Plus paste and anamoxicillin antibiotics. The Diomec you can buy over the counter or online and the antibiotics you will have to get from your vet. This will cost you under $300. It is important for you to give your puppy water with electrolytes every two hours and to feed him baby food every four hours. The dog is not going to drink or feed with any, so you need to use a syringe to force the water and food down his throat. In the mornings and evenings, crush the antibiotics that you got from the vet and mix it with the water you give him and then give him some Diomac. Despite you giving your dog baby food every four hours, Make sure you also prepare chicken breast and rice for him to always have around in his feeding dish. This is just to encourage him to eat when you're not there. Water with electrolytes should always be there. After coming from the vet, it took Gaddafi four days 
for his diarrhea and vomiting to stop. On the fourth day, his stool was back to normal. The first day was rough because he was very weak and had no appetite and kept on vomiting. On the second day, he started nibbling on the chicken and rice. The third day, he started finishing his food. On the fourth day, his personality was coming back. Gaddafi lost a lot of weight and was very weak. It took him another month for him to get back to his old self. If you are going through the agony of Pablo with your puppy, I have listed a few links to some of the products that you can purchase in the description to help your dog win the fight with Pablo. Please subscribe to the channel and press the notification button. Keep watching so you can see how Gaddafi turned out two months later. Thank you for watching this video. Peace.